Hey everyone, GFFs, Growing Forward Friends. I'm Paul Casey and I've started a new series on great things that my clients have said. I write them down, I put little stars in my coaching notes. It's nothing, of course, confidential. It's just great wisdom that they have shared with their team and I want to share them with you. So you're sort of getting the benefit of a secondhand conversation and I hope these leadership principles will benefit you. Today's topic is uh, building trust. So three things that one of my clients said build trust, and one of those is transparency. So that if you're always like playing it close to the vest, putting up a wall in front, uh, just sharing all the things that you can't say uh, with them, which gives them no information, that lack of transparency builds that wall instead of a bridge, and uh, people don't trust non-transparent leaders. They even like your transparency when you just share you're struggling with something. Now, not that you're going to do this every day. You're not going to be self-deprecating all the time, which is going to make them lose confidence in you. But it builds trust when you humanize yourself through transparency. The second thing that builds trust is follow through. So if you said you're going to do something and then you do it, you get another brick of trust in that bridge over to them. If you say you're going to do something for someone and you don't do it or they have to bug you for it, then you have not you've just lost that opportunity to build trust with them. So I'm going to encourage you to have transparency then have the follow through that people can always count on you, that you're going to be a person of your word. And the third one is advocacy. So you might not think about this one right off the top of your head, but when you fight for someone um, in front of your leadership or in front of somebody else, you're actually talking good about them behind their back and saying that this person should be considered for this promotion or for this leadership position or this task then you're actually building trust with that person, thinking like, wow, you fought for me when I wasn't even around. And uh, you were in my corner, and because of that, I bond to you, and I'm going to trust you more. So transparency and follow-through and then advocacy on someone's behalf is going to build those bridges of trust. Okay, if you want to know more information on any of these topics, please hit me up, growingforwardservices.net. Um, growing forward at paulcasey.org is probably the easiest email to get to me. And uh, I want to help you keep, you know, growing forward.